I'm Brian Walden. <laughs> and I'd like to welcome you to a new London weekend television program called Public Interview. Where you, members of the public, <laughs> public figures about various things concerning the public. <laughs> And tonight, our guest is a drilling vegetable called Michael Heseltine. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Heseltine. <laughs> so we now have the question which is conducted this evening by two comedians, one of whom is extremely short. Now, look, no, don't, no. What, <laughs> oh, no, good heavens. What I want to do tonight, you know, I would... <laughs> What, what I would like to do at this stage is ask Mr. Heseltine, if I may, you know, if I may, <laughs> what he thinks about the miners' strike. Oh, for crying out loud, Mr. Corbett, the miners' strike's finished. Can't you ask anything more sensible? I would like to ask something more sensible, if I may. <laughs> um, Let's see what's on BBC One for the day's race are quite lethal because just before the start of this round Britain car race 1986 we in fact had a short sharp rain shower lethal for the drivers but marvellous for us because there's always the chance of a nice meaty accident <laughs> and sure enough it was Lafayette who drove his Ferrari through the hay bales and sheed someone's privates off good luck to you. <laughs> But now the race has settled into a fairly dreary, mundane race as they go over the dreary Chadwick Valley, where nothing's very interesting at all. There is Lafayette Senior back in the race, in the Ferrari, there Savage, and there is, of course, Bertillon, Philippe Bertillon in the McLaren. Ah! My God! Lafayette's disappeared! He's gone! He's banished! He's gone over the brick wall! We're looking at a brick wall now, over which Lafayette went! There's no camera down there! We don't know the fate of the flying frog, but he's not there! The director of cameras, the camera's shaking! We're looking now at a shaking, unrehearsed camera move, and there is a Ford Transit van with hazard lights on! What must be going through the minds as they come now to the brick wall? Yes! What must be going through these men and women's minds as they see dead people lying below? Shall we leave the hazard lights on, David? 